Okay, so let's have a look at using how to use this new presentation software called Sparkle. So this is the web address. Now, if you don't want to um, buy a premium account for £99 or $99, um, this is how you use it for free. So first of all, you need to download the iPad app or the desktop. I'm going to use it for my PC. So this is how I do it. I just run, press run or save it to the desktop and then open up. I've already done that, so I'm not going to do that. And then you can run it from the desktop or run it from the website, but it's best once you've got it on the desktop to run it from the desktop. So here's mine. Double click and run. And it brings me to this. So you also need to create your own um, username and password for the free account. I've got mine here. And so it automatically saves it and then I just log in. So now I'm going to create a presentation. So this is um, how to use Sparkle. Here's my title. I have a text slide. So what's my point? Um, I am trying to use Sparkle. bit of the slide. Now I might want to add a picture for my thing, so I'm going to go to upload a media. I'm going to go to pictures. caption on it. This is altash.net. Then I might put text. So this presentation um, and okay so I think I'm quite happy with this slide so far so I'm just gonna have a look see what it looks like. There you go, that's cool. So I can change the style, make it uh, one of these things like a roller coaster by downloading extra bits and so on. Um, some of them are pro accounts and so on, but I'm going to keep it with this paper because I like that. So there we go, there's my slide or my first one. Now I could make more. Um, by just adding like that and create another slide and so on. I can also add notes to it. Uh, I can also edit what I already had. We're going back to this. Uh, you can add video clips. You can add lots of different things. So then, how do I? How do you actually save it so that you can come back and present this? Well, you go to save. Save as a local file. I'm just going to put it on my desktop. So that's the school bell. Good timing. Um, just save it there. And then I can come back to it later on and so on. So I'm going to log out now and disappear. So I'm going to come and use it again. I go to my desktop, open it up, I log in, I then go to open because I haven't got a pro account and I don't want to upgrade and pay the price. I'm going to open the local file which we saved before called Mr. Hunt. Did we not save it? Oh no, there it is. I haven't called Mr. Hunt. No, that's one of my test ones. Okay. Never mind. Open another one. Maybe I saved it somewhere else, or maybe I didn't save it properly. That's confused me. But anyway, once you've got it saved somewhere and you know where it is, unlike me, you can't find it, you just double click the file. This is one I was just having to play around with before and there's a picture there that I was of myself that I was going to have a test go at. And so there you go, you show the slideshow and there it is. That's how easy it is to use Sparkle. It looks like a really cool tool. Thanks for watching.